What's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be making the delicious Puerto Rican style coquito. If you're new to my channel, go ahead and stop what you're doing and go subscribe right now. you that don't know what coquito is, coquito was originated from Puerto Rico. It is like your Puerto Rican style eggless nog. Now I know it sucks spending this year's holiday in quarantine, but there is a way we can turn it up just a few notches. First and foremost, before we even get to the ingredients, I would just like to say shout out to my mom for passing me down this recipe. Aside from the ingredients, you're going to be needing a tablespoon measure, a measuring cup, and a blender. Now for the ingredients, you're going to be needing cream of coconut, coconut milk, sweetened condensed milk, evaporated milk, one fourth tablespoon of cinnamon, one fourth tablespoon of nutmeg, one whole tablespoon of vanilla extract, cinnamon sticks, and last but certainly not least is the Bacardi. Now I know we have the regular Bacardi in this one. I honestly prefer the coconut flavor. It intensifies that coconut taste. And for me, it just tastes 10 times better, but we have regular Bacardi for now, and I know this is empty, but we had some fun. <laughs> now we're gonna get all these cans open, and I'm gonna start putting all the ingredients together into the blender. And we're back, guys. Now what you're gonna wanna do is start pouring everything in here. So we're gonna start off with the sweetened condensed milk. Look at how creamy this is, oh my god. Now what you're gonna wanna do is start putting your spices into the mix. So if you're a cinnamon lover, you're more than welcome to add extra cinnamon. So I'm going to go ahead and add just half a tablespoon more of some cinnamon. Now you can blend everything together right before you add the alcohol. Now just for a quick taste test. Oh my god. Oh my god. god. So yet again, last and certainly not least, the Bacardi. Now, for the Bacardi, you're gonna be needing about two shots. You can go one shot or you can go version. It's completely up to you. You can also go more. It depends on how much you tolerate alcohol. But we're gonna do two shots of vodka here. But that looks like enough to me. All right, guys, so after you mixed everything together, you're gonna wanna stick your coquito into the fridge for about two to three hours, just because it's best served cold. So I'm going to go ahead and stick everything into the fridge. I'll come back when it's ready. So here is the coquito, guys, the finished product. I went ahead and added a cinnamon stick just for it to look aesthetically pleasing. The cinnamon sticks are optional. That's it for today's video, guys. If you guys like this video, make sure you leave a like down below. If you guys have any video requests, make sure you leave that in the comments below also. Please subscribe to my channel and turn that post notification on so you get a notification every time I post a new video. And that's it guys, happy holidays.